We put a bow on the first week of high school football practice with a trip to a school that's won three consecutive regional championships. The Unity Christian Crusaders, including the 2018 Division V State Championship. Jason Hutton along with Brett Bakita. And Brett, every year without fail, the big story at Unity Christian practice is numbers. And never <laughs> fails. It's the story again, but for a different reason. The numbers are up. And you would think that once they hit that first state semifinal appearance that everyone would be like, oh, man, I want to play football next year. Even though, you know, their attendance in school, they're limited. And they have a lot of great programs with soccer, obviously, that competes with football directly, basketball, baseball, multi-sport athletes. But, wow, to have that many kids. And, and you're going to hear from Coach Tibby talking about the fact that they had some big classes they knew that were coming up. And they still have all three programs, freshmen, JV. It's not like they're combining. It's great to hear for these guys because they built a – unbelievable program 31 guys up 9 10 from a normal year for you christian let's hear from coach and some of the players on having more guys to practice with yeah we're excited to have kids to not have to be in on everything uh, to get a break during the practice to not have to go half line all the time with stuff um, it'll be different it'll be but i'm hoping that it turns out to be a really good experience for us as coaches now too and, and these guys so yeah we definitely have more guys this year we've it's been a while since we've had 30 so that's going to be new. It's going to be that's good, and we got some big guys up front. That's going to really help us out this year. We're looking forward to it. It definitely is. It's a lot nicer too for like when we run full team offense and full team defense. We'll get a little bit more of a break and stuff, having more subs. But yeah, it's a lot nicer now. Another big difference this year for Unity Christian. They're going to play in the OK Blue. They've been in the OK Green. Go way back to their OK White days. They've been used to playing schools bigger than them, and you and I would agree it's benefited them come playoff time. Now they're in the blue. I think they're the favorite in the conference. I would agree, and it's interesting to see what their psyche is going into that because no offense to them, but in the OK Green, you always look at Zeeland West, you look at Zeeland East, Byron Center has had some good teams, so you never really thought about Unity Christian. They were just a smaller school, but it prepared them well for the playoffs. But now I would agree with you. They play Allendale. They've had some great games with them, but certainly when you look at what Allendale lost and Owen Burke was one of the top players last year that's going on to the Air Force Academy, they're going to be, you would expect, down a little bit. Spring Lake is a good program but I'd have to agree with you, Unity Christian. And Book had the stat of the day here. Unity Christian, with all their success, they've never won a conference championship in football in their school history. This could be the year. Could be. A long way to go. We'll see. One of those teams that could contend in the Blue Spring Lake Lakers, Zach Herrick, will be at their practice on Fox 17 News at 10.